You've got a tower? Boy, am I jealous. So hi, Dave, from John G K E 8 G X A, who is Chili Garcia 6854 on apartment antenna and grounding problems. The, this question is, I just purchased a 40-foot radio tower. My question is, what antenna and band is ideal for this height? None of them are perfectly ideal. Here's the problem. If you put a Yagi on top of that or a hex beam, you've got the problem that your height off the ground in terms of wavelengths changes for every band. So if you're 33 feet off the ground, that is perfect for 20 meters. Okay, so you're about just right. But if you go to 10 meters, now you're at two lambda above the ground and you get multiple lobes with very sharp nulls in them. I just did a video about this for my ARRL Ask Dave column. It will come out at the same time as the October QST comes out, which will be in September. And you can actually look at the patterns. The answer is most people ignore that, just put their Yagi on it and have fun, okay? If you're a really big DXer, you'll actually put antennas, several antennas at different heights and then pick the one that works the best. But for the rest of us, that would do just fine. A yeah, tower, I've always wanted a tower. There you go, have fun. Do it safely. 73.